UFC Fight Island 6 is just wrapped up. Here is your full mount MMA recap. If you're not already following us on Instagram, be sure to give us a follow at MMA Full Mount. To kick off the prelim, Saeed Nurmagomedov defeated Mark Striegel via KO just 51 seconds into the first round. Oh, it's hurt bad. It's hurt bad. Oh, my goodness. Tatiana Suarez reacted saying, damn, what a performance for Saeed Nurmagomedov. Vicious ground and pound. And Nico Price says, dang. Thank you so much. I feel great. And I didn't have to uh, get injured or anything. It went pretty fast. Maxime Grishin defeated Gazi Murad on Tigula via TKO in the second round. And that's it. It's all done. John Anik reacted saying, I can't be the only one who thinks that Grishin Cat looks like Paul Felder. Paul Felder says this guy is in fact my half cousin. Man, this is my home. My spirit, like this cage working, you know? I'm funny, funny. Sorry, my English not very well, guys. Ferris Ziam defeated Jamie Malarkey via unanimous decision. Michael Chiesa reacted saying, this is how I feel about that decision. Bilal Muhammad says, oh, I don't know about that decision. And Brian Kelleher says, that's a malarkey. I'm so happy because I, I win, I won tonight. Sorry, my English is very bad. DC, I love you, bro. You are the legend. I'm very happy, but Jamie is a very good opponent, but he says nothing. No kickboxing, only wrestling. Jun Young Park defeated John Phillips via unanimous decision. Park actually broke a UFC record for most ground strikes. He landed 258 ground strikes to beat Matt Riddle's record of 251. You broke the record for ground strikes in the middleweight division in a UFC fight. I mean, how, you landed almost 300 ground strikes. That's insane. UFC record. The UFC record, not even just middleweight anymore. Ah, Chimaev. Oh, more than Chimaev? More than Chimaev. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Cheeto Vera reacted saying Park versus Chemayev next. And Bilal Muhammad says James Tony has better takedown defense than Phillips. Congratulations. I know that you're not happy, but that was a fantastic fight. Great job. Drunk to Tutelazi. Jillian Robertson defeated Poliana Botelio via unanimous decision. Uh, I feel like no matter what, my jujitsu is my thing. We were working a lot on my ground and pound, just trying to really get power in my strikes, which I feel like I was able to do. But uh, I have, I'm trying to get that 100% finish rate, and I ruined it tonight. So I'm like, uh, not happy. <laughs> Guram Kutataladze defeated Matus Gamrat via split decision. After the fight, Kutataladze said that he felt that he did not win the fight. Brother, DC, first of all, I love you. <laughs> Second of all, it's not my fight. This is bullshit, number one bullshit, man. I'm a honest man, you know? And me and this guy work hard. But when the result, it wasn't my fight. The guy did how many takedowns? I'm sorry to say that, brother. But it wasn't my fight. Bila Muhammad says, honest guy, but it was a great fight. Could have went either way. Jan Blahovic says, totally disagree. Gamrat should win this fight. And Jorge Masvidal says, saw that from start to finish. Robbery. To kick off the main card, Jonathan Martinez defeated Thomas Almeida via unanimous decision. Yeah, uh, me and my coach, you know, we worked this all the time. He believed in me. He said, just go in there and just do me. So that's what I did. James Krause defeated Claudio Silva via unanimous decision. After the first round, Krause informed his cornerman that he tore his knee. Okay. No. My knee's torn. You all right? Yeah. I'm okay. Right. Okay, listen to me. You're up and down, you're up and down, meaning climbing the ladder, you gotta work. Okay. okay. He's hurt and tired. I know. Kevin Holland reacted saying Kraus is a fighter's fighter. Michael Chiesa says, I've been saying it for a long time, James Kraus is a top 10 welterweight. Dude is so legit. Megan Anderson says, team Kraus all day. Boss man getting the job done. And Derek Brunson says, nice fight by Kraus and Silva. I see most media had it 2018 Kraus after two rounds. I had it one to one. MMA needs a legit scoring system. The current scoring system is too subjective. Every sport has a definitive scoring system. System, we need to update ours. Jimmy Crute defeated Modestas Bukowskas via knockout in the first round. Ground him and, and oh! What a knockout! Right. Followed up oh, and again oh, and now oh, look! That is it! Wow, what a finish! La Muhammad reacted saying, boom goes the dynamite. John Anik says, Jimmy Crute at his violent best tonight. Destructive. Man is on a light heavyweight mission. Glad I'm not in his way. Aljamain Sterling says that ref saved him. He got a three flash KOs in a three second span. Made a bad read and paid for it. Michael Chiesa says the timing on that right hand from Jimmy Crute was so good and the accuracy on those follow up shots was nasty. That's 50K for sure. And Dana White says, hashtag now you know. I went, <laughs> I went to, to walk off and then I'm like, oh, last time. 
Hey, F that. Okay. I know there's a man that was supposed to fight on this card. Um, I know he won't take me down like a lot of the other guys because he's got Kyokushin spirit. Nikita Krylov, what do you want? Jessica Andrade defeated Caitlin Jukagian via TKO in the first round. Oh, something's happening. Oh, 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 yeah, she's attacking the body. She's down. Michael Chiesa reacted saying, whoa. He followed up with, that's the kind of win to catapult you to the number one contender in a new weight class. Congrats, Jessica Andraj. Angela Hill says, Andraj will steal your girl. Cheeto Vera says, Jessica versus Valentina, make it happen. Aljamain Sterling says, that liver shot looked like it caught Caitlyn on the full exhale. And John Anik says, yet more UFC history for Jessica Andraj, who becomes the first woman to win a fight in three divisions. Vicious body shots get it done tonight. 12 UFC wins overall. She's got a belt at home. Might be a Hall of Famer when all is said and done. We trained that back in. In the, in the locker room, you know, my master was telling me, go to the body, she lost a lot of weight. So that's exactly what I did. We trained a lot of that in Brazil too, but really the strategy was built right here in the locker room. And for the main event, Brian Ortega defeated the Korean Zombie v unanimous decision. Kelvin Gastelum reacted saying, I might just have to shave my head on my next fight too. Dan Ige says, good to see Brian Ortega back in the mix. Look dominant tonight. Excited to see him against Volkanovski. Sean O'Malley says, fucking impressive. Dean Thomas says, man, T-City looked sensational. Bilal Muhammad says, T-City earned his title shot with that performance. Chris Weidman says, that jab was a problem. Diego Sanchez says, always happy to see a fighter bounce back. Brian Ortega with a title shot worthy performance. Gilbert Burns says, looking forward to hashtag Ortega versus Volkanovski. Tatiana Suarez says, told y'all T-City was winning tonight. Congrats, hard work pays off, buddy. Jimmy Rivera says, Brian Ortega went from JIT specialist to kickboxing specialist. 5 and OT City. Nico Price says the Korean zombie couldn't get started and Ortega looked great. Cub Swanson says Ortega looked great tonight. Congrats, homie. And the champ, Alexander Volkanovsky, says T City turned it up. Patience, timing, and great shot selection. It feels good, man. It feels good. But I got one message. All my, all my homies that roll with me, even after the last one, I love you. For all you who counted me out, learn to count my. And that's going to wrap it up for the news. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe to Full Mount MMA and click the bell icon to be notified when we post future ones. Here are the three top comments from last video. The first one says, who else has never bought a Bellator pay-per-view? The second one says, Cyborg back to doing what she does best, crushing cans. And the final one says, it's so weird how disrespectful casuals are to MMA legends and pioneers. It would be easier to admit you just started watching the sport. Those were the three top comments from last video. If you want to be featured on the next one, all you have to do is comment down below. Also, be sure to check out the other types of MMA content we post on this channel. Click either of these two videos on the screen right now.